Hi everyone, and welcome back to my YouTube channel, Iraqi Dinar, I'm your host, Ali, and I hope this video finds you well. It's Thursday afternoon, October 4th, and I'm wishing you all lots of happiness and success. Let's jump right in without any delay. State Bank of Vietnam takes action amid currency fluctuations today. We've got some important updates regarding the State Bank of Vietnam, SBV, and its moves to defend the Vietnamese dong after it recently dropped to a record low amidst the strengthening US dollar. On September 30th, SBV Governor Nguyen Thi Hong addressed the parliament, stating that the central bank is keeping a close eye on the dong's exchange rate as global currency markets fluctuate. What's the strategy here? The SBV expects a reduction in demand for US dollars as companies ramp up forward purchases of the greenback, and they anticipate that the Vietnamese dong will strengthen by the end of this year, especially as the US Federal Reserve might begin cutting rates. The recent depreciation of the dong was mainly driven by global uncertainties, including a delay in the Fed's easing measures. Additionally, import growth has been outpacing exports, increasing the demand for US dollars in Vietnam. But don't worry your experts expect this to reverse soon, leading to more balanced currency flows. Last week, the Vietnamese dong hit a record low of 24,777 against the US dollar, making it one of Asia's worst performers this month. In response, the SBV has been active, selling dollars at 24,450 dong per USD to intervene in the market. Their main goal? To stabilize the currency by adjusting monetary policy tools like reverse repurchase rates, which were recently increased to 4.5%. Despite all this, the dong has only decreased by 0.25% since the start of the year and experts remain hopeful that we'll see it strengthen before the year ends. On the international stage, it's not just the dong feeling the heat. The US dollar has had its biggest monthly gain since September, while the Japanese yen saw its deepest drop in nearly a year. Meanwhile, the euro is holding its ground at around 1 US dollar and 8 cents, with the next big test coming when the European Central Bank ECB, meets to decide on a potential 25 basis point hike. The global financial landscape is ever-changing, and it's crucial to keep an eye on these developments if you're considering investments in foreign currencies like the Vietnamese dong or Iraqi dinar. So that's a quick look at the recent movements in the Vietnamese dong and global currencies. What do you guys think? Will the dong bounce back by the end of the year, or do you see more turbulence ahead? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Iraqi Dinar for more updates on global currencies and investments. Thanks for watching, take care, and I'll see you in the next video.